trends out of style. That is exactly what I'm here to talk about today in this video, and I am so excited about this fabulous video. In addition to the seven trends that are out of style in 2022, I'm gonna be sharing some amazing looks to go along with each of these trends because I'm not only gonna be talking about what you should ditch in 2022, but I will also be talking about what you should swap and what you should be adding to your closet this year so that you will no doubt have a fabulous year looking stylish, looking chic, and looking like the best version of yourself because we all deserve it. Are you with me? If you are, please leave a comment down below because I always love hearing from you guys. So if you would also hit that subscribe button, I would truly appreciate it. I do publish brand new videos every single week and I started my channel about two years ago to help women just like you of all ages look and feel like the best versions of themselves. All right, let's get started. The trends that are out of style in 2022. Trend number one that is out of style is the super tight, low-waisted jegging jean. So this has been out of style for quite some time. What's really trending now is more of the updated skinny jean or the baggier denim, like the high-waisted straight leg denim. And I'm gonna say, if you only add one pair of denim to your wardrobe this year, let it be a pair of straight leg jeans. If you're wondering what some other amazing denim trends are in 2022, you can check out a video I just did on that exact subject, and I will be linking it down below in my description box. So my absolute favorite straight leg jeans are these by Mother. You guys, they're called the Rider. They're my absolute favorite fit that Mother does. I love Mother jeans because they look incredible. They're very slimming, but they're also extremely comfortable. These are a high-waisted straight leg jean, and the reason I love these is because you can wear them all year round. I love them paired with heels, but then the cool thing about straight leg denim is when you wear it in the fall and winter, they pair beautifully with ankle booties because the booties can fit underneath the jeans. And a little style tip, ladies, when you cuff your denim, it's going to do a great job of making your legs look longer and making you look slimmer, especially if they are a pair of high-waisted jeans. So that's honestly the only type of denim I will wear because I'm obsessed with high-waisted denim. And if you are too, please let me know again because I always love hearing from you guys. But these jeans are fabulous. They come in multiple washes. I have them in a bit of a darker wash, which I absolutely love. So highly recommend these jeans by Mother. Again, they're called the Rider. What I paired them with is this awesome blank NYC jacket. This is a really cool puffer jacket and it has a, an amazing insert, like a, a gray hoodie insert. So it's casual, but it's also very chic. It actually gives you that beautiful layered look without the bulk because it is a built-in you know, gray hoodie. So love this jacket. It's a bit oversized, so very fashion forward. And again, you can never go wrong with a camel colored anything. Why? Because anything camel is always going to look more expensive than it really is. Now, I paired this outfit with these awesome booties by Giovanni Rossi. I did find the lace-up version on sale. These exact ones aren't available anymore, but I did find some amazing dupes by Steve Madden. There's some really cool heeled ivory combat boots that I love just as much, and they are under $100. So again, I'll be linking everything that I'm talking about down below in my description box. Okay, another pair of jeans that you can swap for instead of wearing like this super tight, low-waisted jegging jeans are flares. So I'm so happy that flares are back in 2022. I would say they're the most universally flattering type of denim on the market hands down. Why? Because they make your legs look incredibly long because they're high-waisted, and then the hemline just skims the floor or is about an eighth of an inch off of the floor. This is gonna give the illusion of elongating your legs. So I am obsessed with these jeans by Anine Bing. I love the sexy slit up the ankle. They're not like a super high-waisted jean. They're more of like a 10 or an 11-inch 
inch rise, so definitely still considered high waisted, but not like that uber like 12 and a half inch rise. So I love both, honestly. These are very flattering, like I said, and I paired it with a simple under $50 bodysuit from Express. And then this gorgeous gold foil cardigan by Express as well. I love this cardigan. It's actually 50% off, ladies, making it under $50. So honestly, what a crazy good deal. But again, highly recommend these awesome flare jeans by Anine Bing. Definitely in style in 2022. Okay, another trend that is out is dressing down, and now we could swap that for dressing up. So the last year and a half, I guess because of COVID and having to be quarantined, you know, dressing down, wearing sweats, wearing joggers was very in style. But now because we're all able to get out and about a little bit more, dressing up is definitely in style in 2022. And I'm super excited about that because it always makes me feel better when I put on clothes that I love, that I feel beautiful in, that I feel good in. So I'll have to say I was so happy to find that dressing up was a trend again in 2022. So this is a beautiful look that I got from Nordstrom. I love this um, halter top with a matching faux leather skirt. This ensemble is by ALC, which is one of my favorite designers. And again, here's that camel color, ladies, the luxe looking shade that always looks expensive, even if it's not. This is a vegan leather set. So because it is vegan leather, it's a bit more budget friendly than if it were real leather. I love this sexy halter top. It does come in black as well. I've also paired it with high-waisted flares and, and then topped it with like a faux fur jacket. It's a really great look to wear on a date night or a girl's night out. But I did top this look off with a faux fur jacket. This one is old, but I will find a similar one for you guys. I'm assuming that Express or Abercrombie & Fitch has a fabulous ivory faux fur jacket that I can link as well. So this is a great look if you're going on vacation, if you're going on a date night or a girl's night out. Uh, I think this is a beautiful matching vegan leather set that will take you many places in style in 2022. Okay, another thing that is out in 2022 is fast fashion, like cheap items. Stop adding like those easy, fast fashion, cheap items to your wardrobe and really focus on investment pieces because when you buy investment pieces, they will last you many, many years. You won't have to spend as much money as often because an investment piece will stand the test of time. I have done a video on the five investment pieces every woman over 40 needs, so I will be linking that down below as well. But the number one investment piece that I think every woman should own, actually there's a tie, the black blazer and the black leather jacket, but right now I'm gonna be talking about the black blazer. This is the black Balmain blazer. I'm not only gonna be talking about these amazing blazers, but I'm gonna give you the best dupe to the Balmain blazer as well. So the Balmain blazer, the mother of all blazers, the reason is the fit is impeccable. The material is obviously very high quality. I mean, once you put on a Balmain blazer, you will know what I'm talking about. It just hugs your curves in all the right places. The beautiful gold luxe buttons really make this blazer look expensive, look sophisticated, and look polished. So I love, love, love this blazer. The good news is the Balmain blazer in the black and the white are on sale right now, ladies, and fully stocked. So this is a great time to grab that investment piece if you've had it on your mind for a while because they're on sale. And honestly, Balmain blazers like never go on sale. So I was so excited to find them on sale for you guys. Now, if the black Balmain blazer is out of your budget, no worries. I completely get it. Lily Silk makes a black blazer with gold buttons that I actually own and wear, and it is a great dupe of the Balmain blazer. Why? Because it's still a high quality blazer. It still has the beautiful gold luxe looking buttons. So I highly recommend either blazer, and I promise you a black blazer is a staple that will go a long way in your wardrobe, and it will also make getting dressed so much easier for you every single day, I promise. So when I paired this amazing Balmain blazer, with are those same Anine Bean jeans I had on earlier, proving their versatility and wearability. And then I paired it over this awesome Saint Laurent gold bodysuit. This is also on sale on the same website that that Balmain blazer is on sale. This is one of my favorite new websites. They offer designer pieces at very, very 
amazing prices because a lot of these designer pieces are on sale. So this YSL bodysuit is like 50% off too. And I love this luxe gold metallic shade. I think it's very cool, very sexy, and even a bit edgy, which matches my personal style perfectly. I paired this exact look with the white Balmain blazer. I wanted to feature this blazer as well because it's also on sale. I've had this blazer for a few years. I actually purchased mine on sale as well. It was a great investment because I've definitely gotten my cost per wear out of it. I've worn this blazer with jeans. I've worn it over slip dresses, over midi dresses. You know, even with a pair of denim shorts, it looks really cool. Now, if the white Balmain blazer is out of your budget, no worries. The best dupe to the Balmain blazer is this gorgeous white blazer from Express that I actually ordered and I'm gonna feature in a video next week. It's beautiful, the cut is amazing, and it also has those awesome gold, luxe looking gold buttons on it. It's a phenomenal price, so I highly recommend both. I think a black blazer and a white blazer will honestly take you so many places in style, and they're just a great staple that I think every woman needs. Okay, the next thing that is out is a real fur, and instead you could swap it for faux fur. Also, that grungy slash glamorous look is also something that you could swap the real fur for because the glamorous grunge look is going to be so in style in 2022, and I'm actually a big fan of this look as well. So this is a very casual look. I wore to brunch the other day. This is a faux fur Sherpa jacket by Frame Denim. I love the oversized fit. It's very cool, very fashion forward, extremely soft. It comes in ivory as well. And I love this jacket because you can wear it with workout clothes, but, but then you can also dress it up and wear it with denim and look incredibly chic. But since I wanted to be super casual and sort of did that, you know, glamorous slash grunge look here, I threw on a baseball hat. This is a suede hat by Rag and Bone. I've had it for several years. And then these are some amazing faux leather Spanx joggers. I actually did a video styling these 10 different ways. So I will link that as well. These are probably one of, one of my most versatile pants in my closet because you can wear them with heels, but you can also dress them down and wear them with sneakers like I have here. So love these joggers, highly recommend them. They're extremely comfortable and also very affordable. Okay, another way to do the glamorous grunge look is with this awesome faux leather puffer by Blank NYC. I just did a collaboration with Nordstrom and this outfit was on my blog recently. I love this look. Very edgy, very cool, also very grungy and a bit glamorous. The reason it's glamorous is because I have on heels, I have on some fabulous accessories, and I'm carrying a high quality handbag. But I love this faux leather puffer jacket. It has a really cool denim insert that comes on the jacket, so you get that really beautiful layered winter look without the bulk. So I really love this jacket. It's also a very great price. Then I just layered it over a simple black bodysuit. And then these are some fabulous modern skinny jeans. They're a high-waisted modern skinny jean by A Gold E. They're called the 90s Pinch Waist Skinny. I love this faded black wash. And then these awesome ankle booties by Veronica Beer did a great job of fitting underneath the jeans. And then I just did a simple little cuff to kind of make them a little bit shorter to sort of elongate my legs. Another thing that's gonna make you look taller and slimmer in your clothes is when you choose a pointy toe shoe, whether that be a booty or a heel, anything with a pointier toe is gonna to make your legs look longer. So love these booties by Veronica Beard. I think they're fabulous and they do a great job of dressing up this glamorous and grungy look that I wore the other day for my photo shoot. Okay, another thing that is out in 2022 are the boring neutral colors, but let me preface this. Just because they're saying that neutrals are out doesn't mean you can't wear them because what that really means is they're just not like trending, but obviously neutral colors will always be in style. They will always be a staple that I think every woman needs. And even though they're declaring them out of style in 2022, I'm certainly gonna still be wearing neutrals even though they're not a trend because like I said, neutrals are a classic 
you know, color scheme that every woman does need in her wardrobe. But trending in 2022 are these really beautiful, loud, bold colors. One of them being pink. That is probably my favorite bold color to wear. I don't wear it very often, but because it's such a trending color in 2022, I'm gonna try to step out of my comfort zone because hey, fashion should be fun and I'm gonna wear a bit more pink. Starting with this fabulous midi dress by Stodd. I love this dress. It's beautiful, it's form fitting. It's just like a gorgeous pink shade. It's what I'm wearing right now. I think it's fun, I think it's festive. I'm gonna take it to Cabo with me in a few weeks and I love it. I think it would be great for a date night and a girl's night out. It's made of knit material, so it is wrinkle free. It's also extremely comfortable. Now I do have on my trusty Spanx underneath, which literally take at least five to 10 pounds off. So I will be linking those down below as well. And um, I always love topping my midi dresses off with leather jackets or faux fur jackets. This is one by Lamarck. It's a beautiful white leather jacket. And then I just went with some simple gold metallic heels to top off this look. Now, another thing that is out in 2022 are the midi hem lines. However, again, that doesn't mean I won't be wearing them because I'm a big fan of the midi dress and it's not saying that the midi dress is out of style. It's just saying that it's not trending really hard right now. What is trending is either that micro mini skirt, which I will be skipping because I'm 48 and I'm not comfortable wearing like a super short mini skirt. So remember this ladies, you don't have to try all of these trends. In fact, you shouldn't try all of these trends. You should only pick one or two that you're comfortable wearing that look really good on you and then rock those trends. And then really everything else in your closet and everything else that you wear should be more of the basics and the functional wardrobe essentials so that you'll be able to get dressed with ease every single morning. So what is in, like I said, are the really short hems or the really long hems, so like the maxi dresses or maxi skirts. So that brings me to this beautiful ALC cutout maxi dress. You guys, I think this is like the perfect vacation wear dress, and that's actually another trend that's really big in 2022 is vacation wear. So this dress actually encompasses two trends, the vacation wear and the maxi length hemline. Love this dress. I think the sexy cutouts are so cool. I'm actually going to be taking this dress as well with me to Cabo. So you're getting a little sneak peek of my resort wear video, which is coming up really soon. This dress has a really cool back as well. Uh, it's very low in the back and an awesome cutout. So I think it's really sexy too. You could also top this dress off with a jacket if you wanted to cover up a little bit more skin. Okay, the final trend that is out for 2022 is like that super buttoned up look, like the super conservative, you know, wearing your buttoned shirt all the way to the top. You know, that is out of style. What is in style and what is really in for 2022 are the sexy cutout tops and really showing a little bit of skin. So remember this when you're doing that. If you're gonna wear a really low cut top, and you're gonna be showing skin on the top of your body, then cover up the bottom of your body. If you love your legs and you're comfortable rocking that micro, you know, mini skirt, and you're gonna be, like I said, showing your beautiful legs off, then cover the top portion of your body up because that's gonna create balance. For me, I'm gonna be wearing the sexy cutout tops because I love wearing them. I'm comfortable in them, and I just think they're really cool to wear on a date night or a girl's night out. So this top is by RTA. It's a, it creates a cutout illusion because it's got this halter top neckline. I love it topped with a jacket. This is a really beautiful satin bomber jacket by Blank NYC. It's got a crop silhouette, so it's great for petites. And I love this olive green shade. I think you can wear it all year round. You know, wear it in the fall and winter with black and gray, and then you can bring it into spring and summer with ivories and whites. So love this jacket. It's also a very reasonable price point. Now these are some straight leg high-waisted denim, so very on trend for 2022. These are by A Gold E. 
and I love them because they're just flattering. Like I said, they're high waisted, so they're gonna make your legs look longer. I also cuffed them at the bottom so I could show off my fabulous heels. This look also encompasses that glamorous grunge trend that's gonna be so hot in 2022 that I touched on earlier. This look would be amazing for a girl's night or a date night as well. So those were the seven trends out of style in 2022, along with what to swap them for. Please let me know what your favorite look was down below in the comments, because I always love hearing from you guys. Thank you so much for stopping by today. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. And until next time, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.